The Mojave Twins are a pair of geoglyphs located along the Colorado River in Fort Mojave, Arizona, sometimes referred to as North America's Nazca Lines. From this view on the ground, they would be easy to miss. You can't even really tell there's anything there. These gigantic figures can best be seen from the sky above. There are many theories that suggest these designs were actually meant to be seen by ancient travelers from space. Some have speculated that the ancient tribes may have experienced encounters of life outside our own solar system. The Mojave Twins are large human-like figures believed to have been created by the Ketchum tribe. They possibly date back to 900 BCE. Theorists think twins may represent good and evil. The larger one has a huge head with attached limbs. This one possibly represents good. Others speculate that it might be that of an ancient god. The other twin has a much smaller head where the arms are detached from its body. Some believe this twin implies it to be evil. The Mojave Desert along the Colorado River is the only place where figures such as these exist in North America. The word Mojave means people who live along the water. Other sites where these geoglyphs can be found are in Blythe, California and Quartzsite, Arizona. There's believed to be about 120 geoglyphs such as these along the California-Arizona border. Some as large as 170 feet tall. Our best guess is that these are about 20 to 30 feet tall. Unlike the petroglyphs, geoglyphs were actually created by removing the hard desert top rock down to a smoother dirt layer. Whole tribes were thought to have participated in the work it took to create this artwork. It's crazy to think how these geoglyphs have survived over the years. And when you consider they weren't even discovered until around 1932, when pilot George Palmer flew over the area with a plane. As I said before, these could only be seen from the sky. The Native Americans who created these geoglyphs never knew what the end result would look like. How did they know what to even draw? It's amazing they haven't been destroyed by people. Thankfully, they're fenced off now. Thanks for watching. By the time you see us again, we'll be on to our next big adventure. So stay tuned and safe travels.